feel like in a minute I'm gonna need these sunglasses like on my face and not just like a cute little accessory moment, you know, but... My name's Andrew. If you've never seen my face before, I make college and lifestyle related content. And I'm so excited you're here today. I was gonna take you along, you know, give you a little tutorial for the little beat, but I forgot. So here we are today. I really wanna set you guys up, so let me do that and I'll be right back. Okay, so this is my solution. I like the lighting over there better, but we're gonna be here so I don't have to squint because I like to keep these on top of my head and out of my eyeballs. I know they're for sun protection, but I just look cool in them, so I'm gonna wear them. But Today I'm gonna to be taking you all along with me to take photos for Instagram. I'm no like big time influencer, big time celeb. Like I don't get paid just to post photos. Okay, <sighs> let me rephrase. I don't get paid to post every single photo that I post on Instagram. Like there's nobody like, oh, you just posted a photo, let me send you like $500. Although that would be nice. Every photo I take on Instagram is not a sponsorship or it's not paid, but this one kind of is, kind of not. I have a partnership with Savage X Fenty and basically I get some of the clothes each month, post a little photo, cool, bam, turkey and ham. Basically I did that for last month. I already did this month's picture and I'm just taking these for myself if this necessarily isn't part of the sponsor post because I already did that for this month with the new outfit they sent me but they sent me quite a bit of stuff last month and I never took a photo in this like I don't know if you can see the design but it's like so cool so wavy it feels like I'm wearing like a beach towel but in the best way possible so I want to take pictures on this I don't know where I want to do that at where am I doing this at <laughs> We're gonna try a couple, maybe a couple different locations. I do wanna go to a parking garage. I feel like that's like the normal IG way to go. So I'm gonna pull up to a parking garage. I'm not gonna park in that parking garage because I'm not paying. So I'm gonna park on the side of the parking garage, go into the parking garage, and then take those photos. Ugh, I haven't been in front of the camera in so long. I have so many videos that I need to edit that I haven't done yet because I'm a little lazy. I, I, I haven't been busy, don't let me give you that excuse. But I wanna be seen in the light again, hold on. Okay, this isn't better for my eyeballs, but it's gonna have to do for now. Basically, today's outfit details, bottoms and top are from Savage X Fenty. These sunglasses are from Five Below, and all of this jewelry are from different places. If we get into it a little bit, these first little hoops, those are from Target, the second ones are from Every Jewels, and the third ones are from, and my bed's messy. Um, the third ones are from Pavoy, Pavoy, Pavoy on Amazon. If my storefront's still active, I can definitely link those. Um, I just haven't been pushing it like I should have been, and they're like, we're gonna take it away from you, and I'm like, oh, okay, darn. But if it's still there, I'll definitely link the top earrings in my storefront, and you can go check them out if you want to, so, <sighs> yeah. Right now, I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to Duncan and get like a pre-photo shoot drink, and then go. I saw this one person on Instagram, TikTok, I don't know, one of those apps. She, I'm, my arm's getting tired, I'm putting you down. She um, got a frozen coffee from Dunkin', but she ordered it with butter pecan and like caramel, and then she got those chocolate and caramel crunchy things in there. There was like 20 different things on the ticket that she had. First off, you know, I'm on, I wouldn't call this a weight loss journey. I'm just like taking care of myself a little more, and that doesn't fit within the lifestyle I'm trying to live. I'm not restricting myself from things that I want, but I don't need that. So I think I'm just gonna do like a small frozen butter pecan coffee because I feel like I deserve a little sweet treat, you know? Everyone, say hi to your nephew. If you don't know who this is, this is your nephew. His name is Kona. Yeah, he's super sweet. He's only one year old, so he's such a baby, but I love him with all my heart. Okay, he doesn't love me back. That's fine, I don't love you either. Anyways, yeah, so we're about to get in the car, listen to a couple songs. If I can set you up, I did get a new tripod. It's like the gorilla one that it has like those robot looking tentacles on it that you can like grip around different things. So I'm going to try to do that. And yeah, let's go. Um, I'm actually editing one currently. Uh, maybe when I get back, I'll finish editing it. We'll see if it gets put out today. Say hi to the vlog. Hi, vlog. Yeah, okay, let's... <laughs> Five minutes of aim are up. Hey everybody, so we're back like a booty crack. Um, I was gonna go to Dunkin' first, but then I realized like I'd get my drink and then it'd sit in the car and like get melty while I'm taking photos and recording stuff. So I'm gonna do this first and then we're gonna go to Dunkin' and then we're gonna go to Dunkin' right across the way. So I'm gonna take these pics, I'm gonna show you how they came out and I'll be back. I haven't taken them yet because I was just thinking like, oh, how am I gonna like take these photos? So what I think I'm gonna do, either I'm gonna open Lens Buddy. If you don't know what that is, it's basically an app where you can like set up a timer, it'll take your pictures for you. Or I could use my Apple Watch as like a Bluetooth clicker because I don't have 
top of those, but I don't have my Apple Watch. So I'm gonna download Lens, Lens Buddy real quick. I'm gonna take these pictures. I really like this location. It's like, you know, like I'm in an arboretum right now. So I feel like this is a good like natural spot. Sun's hitting the skin, everything's good. So I'm gonna do that and then I'm gonna take those and then I'm gonna show you and then we'll be back. Okay, y'all, so we're moving locations. Still in the same like area, but I wanna get a couple more flicks. I got some really cute, spicy, sexy ones. But I want to get a little more just because the sun's out and it's gloomy a lot here and you don't get this chance every day. Where am I? I gotta walk through all these bugs. Oh no. Y'all, I'm not a nature kind of, oof, I am not a nature kind of guy. I'd like that spot if there wasn't like this whole little baseball thing back there. I don't hate bugs. It's just when I'm in nature, when I'm in grass, bugs kill me. Also, it's like there's a person sitting over there and I'm not afraid to film in front of people, but he looks like he's having a moment and I want to let him have his moment. So I'm just going to take a couple more flicks over here and then I'm going to do it. Oh my God. Oh, I look a mess. One thing about me though, I wish the lighting wasn't the way it was. Uh, I would move, but I'm really not in the moving kind of mood. As you can see, there's no makeup on this napkin because, okay, there might be a little bit. Urban Decay All Nighter, specifically the D Slick one, she'll definitely take that oil away from the skin and just like leave you. It's not like super matte because they do have a matte one, but I don't know, it'll just set. And that man that was having his moment would leave the second I try to go in there. I'm not going back. I'm not getting out this car. Anywho, I got the picks I wanted to get, so that's all that matters. Uh, oh boy, I put them armpits down. Look like I got caked up deodorant on under there. I probably do. Then I'm gonna Get out. I took my pictures, and you can go like them on my Instagram because by the time this video is up, those pictures should be as well. I think, if I like them, I think I like them. I don't know. Just not really like a high stress kind of moment. Like, I'm not turning these pictures into anybody for them to like get approved for me to get paid. Cause like I told you this is not like a, a paid type of moment cause I already did that. This is just like for fun. If you guys wanna know my Dunkin' order, stay tuned. By the way, this Dunkin' order that I'm about to get is not actually, let me mobile order it. Cause I'm, he's eating, y'all. That's not even the whole pic, he's eating. I think I'm just gonna mobile order it because Duncan is, I don't, you can't see it, but Duncan is like right there. And if I don't have to pull up my card, it's a win-win situation. It's just like to use CarPlay in my car, I have to connect my phone. But if I wanna use Apple Pay, I have to deconnect it because my charger is not that long to stick out the window. So I have to unplug it, then the radio starts playing, then I have to pay them, then I have to plug it back in, wait for it to reconnect, and that's just not something I'm willing to do right now. So I'm gonna mobile order it on this app. Why is my lighting situation always doing me so dirty? You're half lit, half not, you look crazy. Oh. I forgot to show you my drink. Hold on. Rewind. Um, I got the butter pecan crunch, I think is what they called it. Yes, that's what they called it. Um, the sliding is about to kill me. Basically, let me stay over here. Basically, it's a butter pecan frozen coffee with with like caramel and like chocolate and caramel crumbles in there. Really delectable. Um, that's all you have to order it as on the app. Like just butter pecan crunch. But if you look on this ticket, there's an S. This is about to piss me off. Basically, it's two pumps of the coffee syrup because they don't put real coffee in it, they put coffee syrup in here. Two pumps of the coffee syrup, two pumps of butter pecan swirl, two pumps of cocoa caramel sprinkles, one cream, one caramel cup drizzle, one, one whipped cream, one caramel drizzle, one cocoa caramel sprinkles. Baby, I told you I was trying to be skinny. What about those ingredients give skinny? None of them. I also got a croissant stuffer. Basically, you know how like Starbucks has like the ham and Swiss croissant? It was that. I got it for $2 because it was a deal, but it's normally like five something. Honestly, for drinks, Dunkin' is definitely less expensive than Starbucks, but for food, it's definitely more expensive than Starbucks. If you want like a um, bacon, egg, and cheese croissant at Starbucks, it's okay. They don't have that. They have bacon, egg, and gouda sandwiches, turkey bacon on an English muffin. Those sandwiches are like three to four dollars. At Dunkin', it's literally like six pushing steps. So I'ma stick by my side. I'ma stick by my girl, Star. <sighs> Anywho, like I said, I'm gonna end this video out because I'm about to go in Ulta to just look around. I'm probably not gonna buy anything. I just need to show off the face because I love going in there when they're like, oh, can I help you with something? And you turn and they look at you and they're like, oh my God, I love your eyebrows. That's usually what they say that they love about me because the rest they like, really can't tell if I'm wearing makeup or not, even though you know I am. You know I don't, I'm not naturally this bronzy. But they're like, oh my God, I love your eyebrows, blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, yeah, and they're like, oh my God, what are you using? And they're like, oh, I gotta use this. I be lying, I be lying straight off the dome. <laughs> straight up and on my lie because I don't know what I put on my eyebrows. I used to use dip brow and I still do sometimes, but recently I got this one eyebrow pencil from Walmart. I don't know what it's called. It's not about the products, it's about the application. And if you don't know what you're doing, don't go out here buying these expensive products to put on your face and look stupid. I mean, nobody asked. Nobody asked.
Yeah, so I'm about to go there, show my butt, and have a good time. With that being said, thank you so much for making it to the end of the video. I really hope you enjoyed. Sorry for my little break here on YouTube. Is there an explanation? No, I just wanted to, but now I'm back. And I hope you're tuned in for the future videos. So, I'll catch you in the next one. Bye! Mm -hmm. Whichever one is in a asshole.